Heading towards base camp, the road soon turned to a dusty trail. It wasn't only the change in terrain we had to watch, but also other points coming down towards us. Base camp, we was greeted by two of Tomo's friends from the MZ Owners Club. So not only was there the three Daves, we also had Tomo, Dick and Harry. But you have to be English really to get the joke. Also, unknown to us, our journey down to Italy had been under surveillance all the way from the UK by a mysterious stalker. My wolf Mel was in on the sting operation, 
I have been relaying our progress to the lone boiker. As we all relaxed in the afternoon sunshine, we were blissfully unaware that he was drawing ever closer. Spotting his prey from a distance, he circled round to our blind side. Then he made his move. Who's this behind me? Yeah. Oh, Jab! You're fucking buggy, you. Where are you? Alright, mate. Turns out it was Nick, a bacon buddy from home. He took a week off work and decided to ride down for the rally and surprise us. Oh, you saw me, did you? I was just seeing walking along here. I didn't realise it was you. Have you already been here for a while? I just got here. Could you have shot it here somewhere? Yeah, try. This rally goer certainly wasn't going to feel the cold this evening. Not since his vehicle had a built in wood stove in the corner. He's sleeping at an all What? He's sleeping at an all Yeah, he went right over it, mate. Oh, 
It was good to see Nick, as he was the one who gave us the idea to come and try out this event, as he'd done it two years ago. There was only one downside, the close proximity of his tent and his snoring. I don't know how his poor wife Carol puts up with it. I'm glad I have my earplugs with me. <laughs> Man has evolved to be civilised, but the quest for fire, and indeed the firewood to burn on it, brings out the hunter gatherer in anyone, especially Nick. Go on, Dave, keep going, keep going. Yeah. That's actually warmer than it was up there. Yeah. Demasiado cable para. Garden is territory, look. <laughs> ain't you, mate? That's your tent, innit? Some campers felt the need to have a home from home, although I'm not sure the postman would come out this far to deliver the letters. There's uh, quite a few more now. I don't know where Dave, Dave and Dave are gone. I've gone for a walk somewhere. I went down to pick up some wood and... Yeah, it's all good. Sorry, not holding the camera straight. It's all good. So, there we are. What a beautiful view. It's 
really warm here at the moment, very, very warm. But come tonight, it's going to be absolutely freezing. But there we are. It's only for one or two nights. Not too close, no? Huh? Not too close. No, I keep turning them. <laughs> it's like baking, you keep turning them and they're all right. Yeah, keep coming off that end. You've got to put the wood on a minute and go. What happens if we're lighting? Oh, look at that, the three stooges. <laughs> Come together as we've got the wood. Yeah. <laughs> we officially have the biggest fire. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what that means, don't you? Everyone's going to come at us. <laughs> Finally, England have won something. <laughs> 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 Finally, we're best at something. Yeah. Yeah, at burning stuff. <laughs> Destroying things. It, it doesn't matter. It's relevant at the moment. Yes. <laughs> Oh. 